Hey, fatty! New low, you fat ass peg! 172.6 pounds, you fat pegs! Now, what have I been doing? I've been doing one meal a day at night, chugging a pile of water before I eat that meal, at least a liter. I chug water all day. I get in a pile of snake juice, snake juice in the morning, snake juice during the day. When I've been chugging water on some of these videos, that water's been plain, but I'm getting a pile of snake juice in during the day. If I wasn't, I'd die from the hot tub turbo cutting. Okay, that's what I've been doing to lose weight this quick. Okay, I'm using the hot tub to cut body fat like butter. Okay, yeah, you drop water. But you know how many calories you burn dropping 10, 12 pounds in a sitting in 90 minutes in a hot tub? It's insane. It's insane. Now, before I get into more hot tub turbo cutting, I'm going to pound this liter and half of water, you fat bags. Okay, I don't drink water like a fat pussy. Okay, I take big gulps. Chug. Don't just sip it like a little bitch all day. Treat it like a meal replacement. So I have some water today. Now this one's room temperature. And like I said, there's no snake juice salts in this, but who cares? I pound snake juice all day. Okay, if I wasn't, when I'm cutting in this hot tub, I would die. You need to take caution if you're gonna do the hot tub turbo cutting strategy to cut weight faster than anything you've ever seen. Now I got this smart one. I'm gonna pound this back. Okay, this is a liter and a half. Liter and a half, you fat ass pigs. Pound a liter right when you wake up in the morning, fat things. Snake juice. Snake juice during the day. Snake juice on your food at night. Pound a liter minimum before you eat that one meal a day diet at night. And if you're not doing a one meal a day diet at night, still pound a liter every time before you eat your fat pegs. Okay, don't worry about diluting your stomach acid, you idiot. If you weren't drinking the water, you're just going to eat a pile of food. What do you think food doesn't dilute stomach acid, idiot? Wait, wait. Water and food's no difference, moron. Except the water's zero calorie, idiots. This is smart water. Now, normally I just drink tap water, all right? I'm gonna go buy smart water and Fiji water and shit. Let's pound some water. Ah! Chug that water, you fat bags. Now the hot tub turbo cutting strategy. So the hot tub I sit in, the best is when it's like two degrees over body temperature. The hot tub I sit in is actually not that hot. I've been grinding out 90 minutes in there. Obviously when I'm sweating my bag off in that hot tub for 90 minutes, you're dumping a pile of water, but it takes a ton of calories, a shitload of calories to dump water, idiot. It's not just a walk in the park. It's not just a walk in the park when you're dumping 10 pounds in 90 minutes, dummy. You can force yourself into ketosis inside of 16 hours. That's how many calories you're burning in that hot tub. Okay, basically what I'm doing is the same thing I used to do when we were cutting weight when I used to box. Or even for powerlifting meets. I'm just applying it to consistent weight loss. I'm doing it every day. Okay, I know my limits. You better be salty if you're going to do this. Okay, make sure you've had a pile of salt the day before and in the morning. Or you can have a seizure and die. I do an hour to 90 minutes in that hot tub. Lately, I've been doing 90 minutes. No cardio other than that hot tub. And that's why I'm cutting weight so quick. No cardio. Two day a week, full body. Okay, I do some hit cardio some days, but there's no steady state cardio for weight loss. 
I literally sit in that hot tub till I can barely hold my head up. It takes me a minute just to get out. Okay, I treat it like hardcore, steady state cardio, like if I'm climbing stairs. Okay, there's effort, a lot of effort. Okay, I start sweating probably at about 10 minutes in. It gets tough in about a half an hour. And then it just gets harder and harder. Okay, it's just like anything else. That's why the best is if you can find a hot tub that's only running at about 40 degrees Celsius, maybe even 39. Okay, which isn't that hot of a hot tub. It's better for duration. You want long duration. You don't want intensity because you have to get out too quick. That's what my routine's been looking like. Snake juice in the morning, a black coffee like two hours after I get up, go to the gym on the off days, mainly just stretching, maybe a little bag work, punching bag work. Then I'll go to the swimming pool and do some hot tub turbo cutting. Then the rest of the day, I'll get in some snake juice, pound water. You need to be getting in minimum a gallon a day. I don't even count a black coffee. Okay, maybe I'll have a green tea midday. Then at night, I make sure I pound minimum a liter of water before I eat my main meal. My main meal is covered with snake juice. I'm getting snake juice in the middle of the day and in the morning. There's no way you can cut like this and not run into massive problems if you're not getting those salts in. I'll tell you that right now. Right now. If I'm in that hot tub and I can't taste salt on my lip when I'm sweating, I am done. I am done. That's when you die. Until next time, chug water and snake juice and get your fat ass in that hot tub, you fat peg.